morning, Bumblebees. Welcome to your English lesson today. So yesterday we were introduced to a new story and we're starting to have a look at the story Stuck. Now yesterday you spent quite a long time having a think about the predictions for the story and then I gave you a little bit more information such as the blurb and then the, fir the front cover and we talked about whether our predictions have now changed because we found out a little bit more about the story. So the first thing that we're going to do today is we're going to um, listen to the story of Stuck. Now, if you've not managed to do this from the school website just yet, head back to the school website now, watch the video that shows the story of Stuck and then come back to this video because you need to have read the story and understand the story before you can carry on with today's lesson. Okay, so if you did go off to um, listen to the story and to enjoy the story, then welcome back. So we're going to have a go at asking Floyd some questions today. And we're going to ask the character some quite specific questions using our question hand um, in order to find out a little bit more. Because it's a bit of a bizarre story in that Floyd gets his kite stuck up into the tree. Now, we've talked about in school how if that happened to us, we would maybe ask a grown-up, ask our mum or dad to help us to get the kite down. Whereas he thinks it's okay just to throw as many different things as possible up into the air and into the tree and then they too become stuck. So we're going to ask some quite specific questions as to why he thinks that's what the most sensible thing is to do. So we've got our question hand here which we can help us in our lesson. So remember we use all five fingers for who, what, where, when, why, where and how is in the middle of our hand as well, okay? And don't forget, whenever we ask a question, our sentence always finishes with a question mark. So we need to make sure that we are using all those that punctuation today. So we're going to ask a character, Floyd the character, a question. So there's not that many characters in our story. We're going to focus on asking Floyd some questions today. So I'm going to ask Floyd, why did you throw all the other items into the tree? Because then that would be a really good question. It's quite an open question for Floyd to have to think about, well, why did I do that? Why did I decide to throw all the other items up into the tree? Now, we're going to have a look at my sentence structure here because I just want to show you that I've started with why, which is one of our question words on our question hand. So that's the first thing, we've started with why, but I've also used a capital letter and I've also used a question mark. So make sure that every single question that you are writing today has those two writing features in it. Okay, I'm going to um, think of another question to ask Floyd. So when you got your kite stuck, how did you feel? Because we're doing quite a lot of work on our feelings at the moment. So how did you feel? So when you got your kite stuck, how did you feel? And think about it. When you're uh, writing these questions, if it was your kite that got stuck in the tree, how would you feel? Okay. So have a think and see if you can empathise with the character as well. Because he's got his toy really stuck up in the tree, hasn't he? So he would be feeling quite sad and quite angry and quite cross with himself that he now can't play with his kite. So again, I started with a capital letter and I've finished with a question mark. So for the remainder of today's lesson, I would like you to write some questions for Floyd. Now you can use each of these sentence question starters more than once. Okay, just try to use all of them. So I have used when, so I'll tick off when. And I've also used why, so I can tick off why. Okay, so remember, draw on the story. Use the story to help you to ask the character some questions. If you send them through to me and I can see the types of questions that you're asking your character, that would be really good to see. Have lots of fun, take care, and I will see you all soon.